The G1 is all about the internet, so let's have a look at what you need to do to browse. First of all, if you want to do a quick search, you can always do it from the home screen, but this time we're going to do it with the browser. So just click browser, and there you go. So, open up the keyboard, and then you're ready to search the web. So if you want to navigate a page, you can do it by just moving it up and down with your hand, or you can use the trackball, like that, and that will automatically highlight links. If you press menu, you'll see the other options you've got, and you've got go to URL, so you can type a web address in, and since it saves your search history, if you've already been somewhere, it'll come up just like it does with contacts, and then you click on it, and it'll load up pretty quickly. We're using Web and Walk here, and it's still pretty fast. So there you go. We're now at the page we wanted, nice and quick. Now when you've got a long uh, page of search results, like we said, you can use your hand or you can use the trackball, which you'll probably find easier. But if you want to go down a long page, hold down Alt and then use the trackball and you'll go up and down much, much quicker. So you can scroll very quickly through a nice long page of search results. Once you've got the page you want, just click on it or you can press return or you can click on it with your finger. All of those will work. And here you go. Pressing menu and windows will show you all the browser windows that you've got open at the time. There you go. Now let's have a look at how you view the pages. So, if you just hold down anywhere on the screen that's got a space, you'll get your zoom buttons up. So just use the plus and minus buttons to zoom in or out. Then if you want to scroll down again, maybe you've got a link there you want to open in a new window. So just long press, hit open in new window, and you'll see you get another window there as well. There we go. So press menu and window again, and you can see all your windows. That little X in the bottom right hand corner is for closing the window. So menu and more, and you'll see there's lots of different things you can do there. Flip orientation switches it from portrait to landscape and back again if you need. Some pages look better one way than the other. Press menu and more, and you'll see there's all your bookmark settings and all kinds of other stuff. So menu and space is what gets you to your home page. Nice little shortcut, that one. Press menu and more and settings. And you can see all the things you can fiddle with there, including setting a new home page if you should so desire. 